Patrick Hurst started with Quail Water Systems as an intern. The company designs, manufactures and exports pumps, valves and all types of water systems for boats and recreational vehicles. 20 years after he first walked through the factory doors, Patrick became Quail's managing director and major shareholder. Patrick has managed to navigate the company through choppy waters. The boat market, in terms of the numbers of boats built around the world, shrunk 70%. The RV caravan market shrunk circa 30, 35%. And yet you doubled staff numbers in those three years. Yeah, we've taken market share. Uh, we've designed really innovative product. We have extended our product offering. So, you know, the value of what we can sell to the customer today, to say four years ago, is four times that value in the RV market and it's twice the value in the boat market. And what countries do you export to now? 48, all around the world basically. I mean, you can be sitting on a flight to America beside a guy who owns a sailboat in Florida and there's every chance if you mention, you know, if you've got a bilge pump and you mention the name Whale, he'll go, oh yeah, yeah, that's an American company. And you go, no, 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 that's an Irish company. And they're obviously uh, quite shocked when they hear that. We've been told that manufacturing is something that has moved to mainland China do you believe that there is a, an opportunity for us on the island of Ireland to compete successfully with manufacturers in those countries? If you just look at Germany, Germany is powering out of the recession. Their auto industry, Volkswagen, Audi, Porsche, registering more cars sold than ever before. Their heartland is manufacturing. I am passionate about manufacturing. I am not putting the white flag up to the Far East in terms of giving in to those guys. We can have a manufacturing base back here. You have to make things that have a distinct added value. So I'm very convinced that in this island as a whole, that manufacturing can survive.